Yo, what's up YouTube? It's your boy VirtueQ back with another video today. It is Friday, October the 23rd, and I'm just uh, really looking for Xur. Anyway, I see a lot of activity over here in the tower, so I'm going to run over here to the hangar. <clears throat> I'm pretty sure he's there. There's no way that it's 5 in the morning, and there's a bunch of guys down in the basement doing nothing. So, obviously Xur's down there, and usually it's a, it's a common spot that he goes to, so what? Just give, bear with me, guys. I'm a little slow here. Let's go. And oh, it doesn't seem to have too much here. Forgive me, I can't really pronounce this. this is the Titan Exotic Helmet Emprian Bellicose? I don't even know if I pronounced that right. Anyway, some of the features it has, aiming weapons while airborne, holds you in place with a full super orbs recharge melee, blah, 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 more super energy from non-guardian kills, shields start recovery immediately after orb pickup. So that doesn't seem to be too bad. I have seen people use this helmet. Uh, I don't know if I recommend it. But yeah, anyway, so the Titan Exotic Helmet, let's see what some of the, feature, uh, some of the other features it has. So integrate thrusters, increased discipline, inverse shadow, heavy lifting, better already. Uh, shield start recovery immediately after war pickup. That's not too bad. Um, and twist of fate. So yeah, twist of fate. You can use those glass needles that are out for purchase, like I spoke about in my last video. Uh, and then it seems to be like we have all of these odd helmets for all factions. Mask of the Third Man. This was in the first year of Destiny. So if you like to use the Blade Dancer, this is a great helmet for you. Uh, arc Blade attacks use less super energy, more super energy from non-guardian kills, replenish health when you pick up orbs. Um, what else does it have? Increased strength, increased intellect, inverse shadow infusion, heavy lifting. So pretty standard. Um, yeah, so Mask of the Third Man, we're no stranger to that. And then for the Warlock Exotic Helmet, we have the Skull of Dire Ahamkara. I don't know if I pronounced that right. Uh, so yeah, you take less damage uh, while using your Nova Bomb. So it's kind of like the unstoppable perk for the Titan, which is when you go into that motion of using that super, you're harder to kill uh, when being shot at. So you're yeah, that's not too bad. Uh, increased discipline. Uh, what else we got? This helmet was also in the first year of Destiny. So. Yeah, once again, no stranger to this helmet. It is. It was there in the first year, and uh, not a, not a bad helmet, I, I guess. Um, let's see what other features it has: increased discipline, hands-on, gain bonus super energy from melee kills on minions of darkness, Invigor invigoration, gain bonus melee. Uh, okay, yeah, okay. Second thoughts, gain bonus super energy from special weapon kills on minions of the darkness so yeah not too bad also we got the exotic engram for the armor and the uh, heavy weapon i don't know if i recommend those they tend to sometimes give year one stuff that's kind of useless uh, other than that the glass needles are there again uh like i said i spoke about those last week and the um <clears throat> if you so if you want to know a little bit more about that you can go to my video from last week but yeah so silvers of glassy material that appear to uh after the flaw of time around them okay well anyway pretty much what that does is like i said you can re-roll your exotic armor pieces to change some of the features it may have so for example let's go here and you can use twi so yeah the twist of fate you need the glass needles and you can re-roll any of these so instead of you know strength you'll get intellect or you know change hands on blah 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 anyway pretty much speaks for itself uh, it will change these features on the armor piece itself so if you're not happy with them and you want something different you can roll your luck and use twist of fate uh, to re-roll these so yeah that's pretty much the glass needles other than that the three of coins are back um, they're not as powerful as they once were when they first came about um, they don't I mean they're not too bad you know you have a higher chance of an exotic engram, uh, exotic engram or exotic piece dropping in your next ultra kill uh, so you know those are if you're really struggling for those you could always purchase that uh, modal blights I don't know why they're changing that, why they're still giving those away but anyway like I was saying about these engrams they're a little risky they're a little risky considering in the past I've, I have purchased this and they gave me year one 
uh, items. I don't know if they fixed that. You can do some research on your own. But yeah, other than that, guys, that's that concludes this video. Thanks again for tuning in on to Where the Fuck Is Zer. And uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoy it. And please subscribe if you guys haven't already. And thanks to those of you who have. Until next time, this is your boy Virtue Q. Stay virtuous. Peace. My will is not my own.